Hello everyone, it's Aino and today we'll make a new tutorial about how to make a wallpaper. So I already make one but this one is really different. So yeah, I will try to, to show you. So for this tutorial I will take Atrox from League of Legends. So I will open it with Photoshop like this. Okay, I will make a new file just here. So for the size, you can put your own size, so do what you want, okay. So I will go back on the first file. I will drag the picture on my new file like this. So we need to put the picture on the middle of your screen. So now click on the first layer, it's your background. And we will put two guides on the middle of your screen like this. So, if you don't see the rule just here, go on view and rule. You need also the snape. Then you will just drag the guides and you will see it will stop like this. So now we have the perfect middle of your screen. So go back on your first layer. You will go on edit manual transformation so now i don't know if you can see this but there is a dot on the middle of the picture and it should be just here on the middle of your guides now you just have to click just here or push enter you can also hide the guides so you can remove like this or go on view, show, and guide. All right. The next step is to erase the top and the bottom side. So you just need to take the rectangle tool just here, and you will make a selection like this, and you will erase. So you can push delete like this and do the same thing for the bot side a little more maybe all right now we will add the render so take your render open it with photoshop like this drag it on your file and you will put it on the same position like this. All right. Now we can erase this part because it's ugly. So take your erase tool just here. Open the window shape. And all you need it's a runeness to 0. For the size it depends of your five resolution. So try to do like me. All right, now go back on your first file, this one. We will drag it like this. And you need to put it on the middle of your screen, like this. Now go on Edit, Manual Transformation. Now you will take this side, but you need to keep pressing Shift and Alt together, like this. So we keep the same size everywhere and push enter. Put your layer behind everything except the white background and we will add a blur effect. So go on filter, blur and Gaussian blur. And we will put 20 pixels. Okay. Now we will add a edges to this border so go on this layer, this one, right click on it, option, edges, just here. For the size, 
we'll put one pixel and just push OK. Now we will make a new layer. So go just here. And we'll make a different border. So take your rectangle tool just here. And you will do something like this. Try to get the same size top and bottom side like this. All right. Now you have to right click on it. Edges. And click OK. One pixel for the size and white for the color. OK. So now go on Edit. Manual transformation and just increase the left and right side like this. Press OK. Now go on selection and deselect like this. All right. The next step is to add a shadow to Atrox, our champion. So go on this layer, the render, duplicate. So go on this option and duplicate the layer. Okay. No, right click on this layer, option, add a new color, just here. So for the color, we will put black and say OK. We will just change the opacity to 40. Go on Edit, Manual Transformation. So now take these dots and put it like this and double click or push enter all right so the final step is to add some colors and lights so we will add the sun effect so i will show you how to do it on photoshop it's really easy so you need to take the paint bug tool just here so i think you, you see this, the gradient tool, but you have to change to the paint buck, just here. All right, take the black color and click on the screen. Yeah, it's for black, it's, it's fine. <laughs> just change the mode here to screen. Now go on filter, render, and lens flare. So now you can change the direction of your sun. So I will do something like this. So I took the first one here, and for the light, I put 100. So click OK. So now you have your sun. It's an easy effect, but it's really cool. So I am not gonna show you how to make the effect on the font and the text, because I already make a tutorial about this and same thing for the curve and the colors. So you can check the tutorial just here. And I hope you like this tutorial. And yeah, I am waiting for you to show me your creation now. So thank you for watching and see you soon for the next video. Bye.